Charm students, it's Mr. Clifford. It's time for a quick overview of Microeconomics Unit 4, Imperfect Competition. Now, the last unit you learned about perfect competition, right? You found out there's four market structures, perfect competition, and then the other three. Well, it's now time to learn the other three. The most important one, the one you have to know, is monopoly and the graph that grows with it, right? A monopoly looks different than a perfectly competitive firm from the last unit. There's not going to be a horizontal demand. There's actually going to be a downward sloping demand. You're going to find out the marginal revenue does not equal the demand this time. Just trust me. It'll make sense. You're going to take the marginal cost and the average total cost you learned in the last unit, and you're going to put it on this new monopoly graph you're going to draw, and, and it's the same thing over again. Identifying the box of profit, identifying total revenue, and be able to read and understand the graph. You're also going to learn about monopolistic competition. right? Monopolistic competition is like a monopoly, and it's like perfect competition, kind of jammed together. Right? It's a monopoly that other firms can enter, and if other firms enter, you make zero economic profit in the long run. Right? So you have to learn that graph and what that, how that works. You're also going to learn about oligopolies, and you're going to learn about game theory. Make sure you learn the grids, something called dominant strategy with a game theory matrix. Now, i got a bunch of practice videos to help you understand the concept, so don't skip the practice videos, all right? Good luck on that. Till next time.